Hi, I'm Dakira. I'm a public health nurse with the Fairfax County Health Department. And I'm Elisa. I'm also a nurse here at the health department. Here's the thing. Not everyone who gets ill with COVID-19 will need medical care. In fact, most will only have mild to moderate symptoms that will not require hospitalization. Still, we recognize this is a new illness and, as with anything unknown, it is scary. There is no vaccine for COVID-19, so today we want to share with you some guidance on what you can do at home to take care of yourself if you get sick with COVID-19. First, stay home. People who are mildly ill with COVID-19 are able to recover at home. Do not leave your home, except to get medical care. Avoid visits to public areas, as well as public transportation, ride sharing, and taxis. If you do have a medical appointment, call ahead as your doctor will need to put in place special infection control procedures prior to your arrival. When you're sick, be sure to separate yourself from other people in your home. Designate a room or area that's away from others to use as the sick room. Use a separate bathroom if available and limit contact with people, pets, and animals. If you are sick, wear a face mask when you are around other people and before you enter your doctor's office. If you cannot wear a face mask for any reason, be sure the people you live with stay in a different room. When your caregiver enters the sick room, they should wear a face mask and do not let anyone but the caregiver enter the sick room. Next, a reminder to use good etiquette when you're sick. Cover your coughs and sneezes and dispose of tissues immediately in a lined trash can. Wash your hands immediately with soap and water for at least 20 seconds. If soap and water are not available, clean your hands with alcohol-based hand sanitizer that contains at least 60% alcohol. And remember, wash your hands frequently and avoid touching your face with unwashed hands. A sick person should avoid sharing personal household items such as dishes, drinking glasses, cups, eating utensils, towels, or bedding with other people in your home. Wash personal items thoroughly after using them, either with soap and water or in the dishwasher. Be sure to clean and disinfect all high-touch surfaces every day in the sick room and bathroom. Limit cleaning of the sick room to the sick individual or their caregiver. Let someone else clean and disinfect surfaces in the common areas. If a caregiver is cleaning the sick room or bathroom, they should do so on an as-needed basis and wear a mask. Be sure to also disinfect high-touch surfaces of personal items such as phones, remote controls, counters, tabletops, doorknobs, bathroom fixtures, toilets, keyboards, tablets, and bedside tables. The CDC recommends cleaning the area or item with soap and water or another detergent if it's dirty, then using a household disinfectant. You can find more details about disinfecting protocol on the CDC website. Finally, monitor your symptoms. Seek medical care right away if your illness is worsening. For example, if you have difficulty breathing but call your doctor before going in. Be sure to follow the care instructions you received from your healthcare provider. If you develop emergency warning signs for COVID-19, call 911. These include trouble breathing, persistent pain or pressure in the chest, new confusion, inability to arouse, or bluish lips or face. We recommend that you follow these procedures to take care of yourself when you're sick throughout your self-isolation period with COVID-19. Your doctor will let you know when you can discontinue self-isolation. You can also find information on this on our website, www.fairfaxcounty.gov health. We hope this information will help keep you and your family safe during this difficult time. Please call our information line if you have any questions about what you just heard. The number is 703-267-3511. You can also find COVID-19 updates and information on www.fairfaxcounty.gov slash COVID-19.